All right, everybody, welcome to the day in the life vlog. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy it. I'm at the beach right now. I just filmed a couple vertical TikToks on my camera, so you will be seeing those if you follow me on TikTok. Uh, but yeah, here, we're at the beach. I just jumped in the ocean, got my workout in. Um, and yeah, I'll show you guys my morning routine, but I thought that this was a perfect place to do the intro because look at this shit. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoy this video. Drop a like, drop a comment if I should do more of these because I love showing you guys my, uh, my daily life. So I love you guys, thank you for being here, and I will see you in the rest of the video. Uh, yeah, we're about to go to the gym. Not having a Celsius today, it'll always fuck up my stomach. Um, today I'm gonna have a coffee instead. Let's see, let's see how I feel. Uh, yeah. so let's go. Hop in the whip and go to the gym. See you guys next. See ya. Ben, thank you for sending me this song. This song is fucking flames. It's a great start to my morning. Fucking heat. Absolutely heat, bro. So right here is where I'll usually sit in the morning and be like, fuck. I need some gym motivation, but then I always remind myself that motivation's not a real thing. And the only thing that's gonna get me in the gym is discipline, not motivation. Um, so I sit here, I meditate for like two minutes, three minutes. Um, I used to check my phone when I would do this, but then I realized like that's just fucking stupid, why would I sit here and scroll before going into the gym? Um, so, I'm not gonna check my phone today till after I go to the ocean after the gym. So, I'm gonna get a sick fucking shoulder and chest pump in here today. And uh, we're gonna see, we're gonna see how massive we can get our pump. <laughs> Look who it is. Showing up really promptly. This man's punctuality is unbelievable. 849. Right on time. Yeah, you feel it? So I was saying how you're yes. blessing that you're healthier than 99.9% I am. I don't compare myself to 99.9% yeah. So I'm essentially done with my workout. I'll, I'm going to keep hitting shit, but I had chest, shoulders, and tries today. So I had dumbbell bench, tricep extension. Pec fly, and then I did a two, two uh, so I did six sets of uh, lateral races, one with dumbbells and one on the rope. Uh, I did some shoulder press, uh, push ups, and now I'm doing abs and just finishing my arms. So that's my that's my workout. I haven't checked my phone yet, only to text this guy. Uh, are you, uh, he runs around like a gazelle. Guys, keep in mind this guy is literally. He weighs as much as your average middle schooler, so you know he's. Yeah, he's, that should that should be your goal to weigh as much as a middle schooler. And see your muscle striations, so you don't need to eat unhealthy food to bulk. It's unnecessary. You totally just unnecessary. Just eat more ground beef. Like eat more ground beef. Eat more steak. That's it, and you can look like this. You don't need to bulk. It's fucking. Stupid. If you want to look like that, yes, you can. It's fucking stupid. It's very attainable. Bulking is stupid. All right, so I just went to jump in the ocean over there. Now I'm heading back to the whip and we are going to get ready really quick because I have a haircut at 10.30 um, and I'm probably going to be late because I just had to film some vertical TikToks over there because that scenery was crazy. So now we're on the way to the back at home and I'm going to have to get home and then go to get my haircut. <laughs> we're going over here. I need to have my beef organs. Organs. Okay, got oh fuck. I usually have this before my workout and then I'm going to have a fucking beef stick as well beef stick and come on back I take three at a time because I've kind of just built like that also if you want those supplements I'll put a link in the but the description below so they're fire they're just straight up organs I don't know if you guys can tell but I'm in a rush just because I hate I absolutely hate being late for things. Uh, I just, I'm, I've always been punctual my whole life. Um, so I don't wanna like, fuck my beef stick. I don't wanna like have my barber sitting there waiting for me. So I just, I hate making people wait for me. I've never, I've always been on time to everything. And I feel like if you're not punctual, you need to fucking work on that. Cause you gotta respect other people's time, bro. Come on. 
Come on, let's go. I forgot my phone, bruh. Alright, we're gonna drive the Jeep because I never drive this thing. Because someone stole my fucking window. What the fuck is that? But yeah, someone stole my window, so how, how nice is that? That someone stole one window. And I never drive this thing because the doors are all so fucked up. Don't know why, but this thing right here won't come out anymore. So if anyone knows how to fix that, let me know. So the doors literally just all swing all the way open. It makes no sense. And it's a fucking mess in here. Oh. Will someone buy this thing off of me, please? Jeez. Got here. Oh, I got here at exactly 10.30. I'm about to go in now. Here's where I get my haircut. It's in Brickle. Can't really see anything, but yeah. Here's where I get my haircut. All right, so I just got my haircut. It looks weird right now, so don't roast me. And now I am in traffic. I just went to Whole Foods and got everything I needed for my acai bowls. I spent $100 at Whole Foods. You can't really go to Whole Foods without spending $100. Uh, so now I, my energy is in a great spot today because I haven't had any energy drink. I had coffee instead of Celsius today, which energy is phenomenal today. So now I'm just like, go, 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 go. Um, because I'm trying to get upstairs, upload a TikTok. All right, buddy, come on, come on, come on, come on. Love Miami traffic. It's probably my favorite thing ever. Uh, but yeah, now I'm ready to just go live, upload a couple videos. And uh, I have three client calls a day. So if you guys want to be a client, hop on one-on-one -on -one Zoom calls with me. You can apply in the description. Uh, but yeah, let's have a fucking productive evening. So for everyone wondering what I put on my acai bowls, goji berries, nibs, grain-free granola, local honey, and then I have frozen pineapple, blueberries, strawberries, and then frozen acai with a bunch of meat. Uh, because I feel like there's a food shortage coming if you haven't seen my TikTok about that. Um, I've been informed from someone that knows a lot more than I do that there is gonna be a food shortage coming. Uh, but I'm, I, I don't know. Obviously no one can predict the future, but I'm just gonna buy food and put it in the freezer because it's not gonna hurt me. It's just not stupid to be smart, I guess, so. Yeah, and then I got some bison skirt steaks. These are my favorite, these are like five bucks. And fucking insanely tasty. And yeah, gonna have some liver today as well. And yeah, let's get to fucking work. It is now 12.30, I have not eaten anything today, so I will be having a bison skirt steak. Like I mentioned earlier, um, I usually have an acai bowl for breakfast, but Breakfast is usually at like 10 o'clock, but I was getting my hair cut. So today, steak, and all I put on my steak is salt, cayenne, and butter. That's it. And that's all I'm gonna have for lunch. Maybe an avocado, I'll have an avocado too. Uh, and then I'm gonna get fucking right back to it, but I just edited a video, and then I'm going to maybe go live on TikTok, uh, and then have a couple client calls. Here is to put the butter on your steak after you cook it not while you're cooking it, and then you melt the butter on it while you're cooking it, or while, while it's done, so like that. And just so you guys know, that literally took me five minutes. It took me five minutes to make my fucking lunch. Efficiency, baby! Now I'm All right, so now I am working on this new course, another one, yeah, my third course. What are you gonna do about it? So this one is for content mastery, so uh, this is gonna be only for like entrepreneur, well not even only, but it's gonna be a $5,000 course, so it's usually gonna be for businesses that need to like really learn how to utilize TikTok organic growth and convert followers to people in their business. And I pretty much cracked down the formula on how to do that. Um, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna create a course, sell for $5,000, but not only give them the course, I give them access to me as well. So uh, yeah, so I'm working on that. That's gonna be a process, but I got the energy, let's do it. That purple, bro. Fuck. My acai bowl game is undefeated. Like, look at the colors, bro. All right, so it's 5:18 right now. Um, just had some client calls, and now I'm live on TikTok. Everyone in here, say what's up. If you want to see yourselves on YouTube, say what's popping. Fuck, it's not focusing. There we go. Say what's popping. I guess I have like three more seconds to say something if you guys want to be in the YouTube video. Nice haircut, thanks man, appreciate that. It means a lot. 
All right, you guys are gonna see your names in a YouTube vlog tomorrow if you guys go check it out. Here we go, I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. Here are the vibes in Miami right now. Fuck it. I should probably go outside. I haven't been outside at all today because I've been so fucking busy. Happened with the Georgia Guidestones. Right? On the way to Jiu Jitsu with the fucking boys, Eric. First timer. <laughs> Eric, how do you feel before? We're gonna get an after as well. You know, I'm ready. I'm ready to look like a fool. I'm ready to look stupid. But I'm ready to learn. That's what's most important. You know? Abe, how you feeling today? Saucy, bro. You guys say bad. <laughs> knees over toes, guy. Knees over, <laughs> knees over toes, guy. Man, you gotta train that tibialis, man. <laughs> Alright Eric, post first jujitsu. Oh man, you really got me just like whoa, How you feeling? Whoa. I feel I feel pretty great. I feel um 
I feel humbled. No mat, no shoes on the mat, please. Oh. <laughs> this is like out of my face, you back me up. Uh, no, nah, I mean, feel great. Got to do with these guys. We got a small, intimate, quality group. I learned a lot and still I, I did so much. I just, I don't know. I'm kind of speechless, honestly, but it was great. The words will come to you at the yeah. right time. Yeah, yeah. Right, Tyler? Hell yeah, bro. Stick with it. More to come. I'll put it that way. More to come. All right. I'll have more to say when I have more to say. Nice. And you're really getting in my grill right now. Alright, so it is 9.15 at night. I just found some chips at Whole Foods with no bad oils in them. Avocado oil. Got some guacamole, kombucha. About to chef up another steak. Um, have some more organs. And then call it a night. Maybe I'll write an email to my list. Um, but wow, what a, what a great day, guys. Like, you know, I'm not sure what the world will become, but I'm grateful for what it is right now. And I'm, I don't want to live in a fearful state about what the world can become and all this negative shit that can happen. But my direct present moment is always beautiful and so is yours, right? Like all this shit can happen, but when you look around you and you look at your immediate present moment, it will always be beautiful and you can count on that. So enjoy life. Who knows where it will take us? Who knows what the world will be like? But right now, it's about as normal as it'll ever be. So enjoy. Yeah, that's wonderful. And we got the lo-fi on. Vibidos, vibidos. Head to my room where the vibes are immaculate. Um, well, look at that. Fucking love my room. But uh, yeah, it was a really, it's a really good day. I'm really fucking sore right now, like criminy Christmas. I am sore. My back sore, my lower back sore. I got beat the fuck up from jujitsu. Um, but it was so nice being there with my boys. If you guys haven't started learning self-defense, I would highly, 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 highly recommend <clears throat> learning self-defense, especially if you're a man, you need to know self-defense. Um, but you guys know how I do my videos. I got nothing but absolute love for you guys being here and supporting me. Um, so grateful. So fucking grateful. <clears throat> um, yeah. It was an awesome day. I'm constantly learning a lot. Now I'm about to go journal on my computer. Maybe send an email to my email list. Maybe we'll see how creative I am. That steak kind of just took the life out of me. Um, and I just, I love getting a good night's sleep, waking up at like 7.30 and then just having a productive day. Because um, you guys know I always say like, to have a good day, it doesn't start in the morning, it starts the night before. Like you gotta set yourself up to have a good day. Um, yeah. I, uh, I re recently really internalized the fact that um, the reason I'm not like a mainstream influencer and not, like no one, not everyone knows about me is because I'm talking about like the truth, you know, like and ignorance is bliss. The algorithm doesn't want to show people the truth. People don't want to hear the truth because they don't want to think. This is what I've realized is that people do not want to think. That's why all stupid content goes crazy because people don't want to think. But I'm glad you're here because you are one of the few people that actually enjoys thinking and not being stuck in the matrix. So hopefully I can help a good amount of people get out of the matrix to some extent. Um, but yeah, I love you guys. I'm about to sleep so good. So fucking good. Uh, but if you're watching this during the day, which you probably are, I hope you're having a fantastic and productive day. Um, I hope that this video gave you some entertainment with a little bit of inspiration, some knowledge, and hopefully uh, you guys will drop a comment, drop a like so I can reply to them and see how you guys are doing. So thank you guys for being here once again. I love you. Stay positive. Stay productive. Stay woke. I love you.